The Federal Aviation Administration says it's considering a plan to require opioid overdose reversal drugs like naloxone and emergency medical kits on board passenger aircraft. Morgan Wright reports. The opioid crisis has gripped uh, every state, uh, every district in, in the country. And Rhode Island Congressman Jim Langevin says there's need to combat the opioid crisis in the skies. Last August, I led a letter to the FAA administrator uh, asking that they include including naloxone. Langevin says this comes after an airline passenger died from an overdose while on a flight from Boston to Los Angeles in July. I think the airlines need to be prepared for any type of an emergency. And in a letter to lawmakers, FAA Administrator Steve Dixon said the FAA is currently reviewing the best way for air carriers to include opioid antagonists like naloxone as part of onboard emergency medical kits. Recent statistics from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention show that more than 70,000 overdose deaths have occurred in the U.S. and experts say naloxone could be part of the solution. And naloxone is is blocking or reversing the effects of opiates. Dr. Zaina Saliba is an assistant professor of psychiatry and behavioral sciences with George Washington University. She calls the drug an antidote to an overdose. It is absolutely important because it is life-saving. Current law already allows airlines to carry naloxone, but Langevin's request would make it a requirement. Reporting in Washington, Morgan Wright.